Hello, so this is Star Wars Episode 1 Racer, and it's um, supposed to be pretty good. It's um, obviously based on the, the very first Star Wars film. Well, you know, the new very first Star Wars film. And it's supposed to be very much like um, F-Zero and stuff, so let's check it out and see what it's like. Okay then, so there's the um, annoying Anakin Skywalker. Never heard of you, never heard of you, never heard of you, never heard of you, never heard of you. So let's go back to um, Anakin Skywalker. Let's see, have a look for a variety of options like vehicle upgrades. You can look at the vehicle, buy parts, but um, let's just go to the racing. I do believe that's Greg Kreutz's voice. Okay then, so um, let's get ready to start. Oh, and I'm off the back there because I was using the right trigger instead of the A button to fire. Nice and quick though. Awesome music, goes without saying, it's Star Wars. Um, I'm at the front already, nice. Oh, so you can change here. Oh Christ, that's a bit difficult. Oh, oh, let's go back to, oh Christ, well that would be, that was a bit hairy. This is pretty good actually, really nice sensation of speed to it. I like a lot of the young races on the Dreamcast. It's a new lap record. Thank you very much. I can't help feel though that it needs like big guns or something so you can just like blow this shit out of somebody as they go by you. But um, no, this is pretty good. Oh I see, that's to um, get through narrow, narrow sections I'd imagine. Right. Oh sh <laughs> That wasn't good. Well the triggers don't seem to do anything, which is a bit of a disappointment. Although I suppose you could maybe set them to ex accelerate in the options. It's a new lap record! And we're on the final lap. Oh, it's exactly the same place. Yeah, I won! I won! 
Oh, he's got such an annoying voice, hasn't he, old Jack Lloyd? I can't imagine there's another kid with a voice that's equally as annoying. Anyway, let's um, head on to the next stage. Right, well, I've got enough to buy it, so I get that. Is. Okay then, so here's another video, just showing the next, next world we're racing on. I'm not a Star Wars fan, so I can't tell you, well, I'm not a hardcore, I can't tell you where we are at the moment. But I'm pretty sure this is industrial world. <laughs> And that's the space around the town. Well, I've done exactly the same thing again, I'll press the wrong button. Well, I've got some sort of H snazzy HUD on me now, so I'm assuming that's maybe due to what I bought to um, upgrade my ship. And as you can see, it's showing the, um, oh, Christ. It's showing how we're doing on the track, which is quite a neat idea. It's a new lap record. Yeah, I've got to admit, um, I could see myself getting quite into this, nice and fast. It's obviously based on Star Wars, which is never a bad thing. And it's got a nice, epic feel to it. So yeah, um, I've been quite disappointed with a lot of the races I've played so far on the DC. So um, it's nice, nice to find something which is um, a bit nippy. I just wish there was a bit more of a challenge to it, because so far it's not really asking much of me. Oh look at this, I'm going to lap someone. So anyway, this is Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. I'm Darren Jones, editor of Retro Gamer, and I bid you farewell.